Are you tired of this? You guys know where Thomas is? He had to go make up a test. Nobody know what he was doing last meeting? Let's check the engineering notebook. Good idea. Yeah. Then you need to try this. You guys know where Thomas is? He had to go make up a test. Nobody know what he was doing last meeting? Let's check the engineering notebook. Good idea. Yeah. Sweet. We can just pick up where he left off. Can someone get me a Kepna? Yeah, sure, man. No longer must you struggle. Try this new and improved engineering notebook today. Hello and welcome to the Engineering Notebook Crash Course by Team 7123, the Fellowship of the Loose Screws. We've noticed that several of our fellow FTC teams struggle to document the journey of their team. And in all honesty, we weren't that great at it for probably three years, but we think we've come up with a very solid documentation system. We want to help you document your robot. Let's get started. The first video in this series will highlight the pros and cons of having a typed engineering notebook versus a handwritten one. The second video will help you organize your notebook and make it easier for your readers to navigate. And finally, the third video in this series will highlight how to make a concise and meaningful entry. We understand that writing about what you did isn't exactly the most pleasant experience, but it really does help your readers understand what you did throughout the year. Plus, it can help you remember what you've done. Join us in the next installment of Engineering Notebook Crash Course to, do, to see a debate between an online and written engineering notebook. See you then. Stay classy, FTC.